Did you know that 7.9 million people tuned in to watch the first episode of this year's The Great British Bake Off? That's over a million more than last year. I think it was the perfect timing and it was exactly the wholesome content we all needed to bring the nation together and get involved in some drama on Twitter. Not many other shows become such an online event, but The Great British Bake Off just do it so well. It makes me want to always watch the episodes live, which is unusual for me, um, just so I can scroll and w see the social commentary that's going on during the show. People discuss the contestants, critique the cake creation, and quote Prue's endless innuendos. Even some big brands get involved. Innocent smoothies are always jumping in and tweeting live throughout the show. Yorkshire Tea do it really well as well. Um, and if you are looking for someone to follow to get all of the Bake Off gossip and also get some stats on how many handshakes Paul has been giving out, you should follow Scott Bryan, he's a TV critic and is the best at live tweeting through Bake Off. In the first episode when Sura knocked Dave's pineapple upside down cakes on the floor, Twitter lost it. I couldn't keep up from scrolling with all the new tweets that were coming in. Channel 4 and the official Bake Off Twitter account do really well of building up these audiences online. Throughout the week, Bake Off will be tweeting GIFs and memes and sharing content that's already happened, maybe last series or last week, and also sharing some GIFs from what's coming up. So it gets people involved straight away, building up to the next episode. Their sister show, An Extra Slice, encourages people to share their own cake creations, which has prompted endless user-generated content that gets shared across social media not always for the good reasons. With fan interaction growing online during live episodes and audiences being built on social media around TV shows, the way producers create TV shows like this might change in the future. It might change the way they focus on storylines or themes or make things a little bit more dramatic so they know they'll get a reaction on social media. So time will tell, we'll see how it goes and if any other TV show can build this sort of audience online as they are showing the live episodes. In a comment below, let me know what your favourite cake is and I hope tonight you will be live tweeting through Bake Off.